What is up? What is up, sports fans? My name is Jake Iggy, or Iggy for short, and this is Iggy's Sports Talk. Wow. It's been a while since I've said that, and boy, have I missed recording this podcast. I apologize for the short hiatus that I have not been posting on this podcast, but it's mainly been because I've been busy graduating college. I just graduated from Plymouth State University, and I'm officially a college graduate. It's honestly crazy to say that. And I just have started a new job as a sideline reporter and video board operator for the Nashua Silver Knights, but I'm still always going to be doing this podcast. And it's really crazy to look back over this year and a half. It's almost two years in August. It's going to be two years since I started uh, recording this podcast and even started Iggy's Sports Talk, just in general. And I just want to say thank you guys so much for all the constant support. Even, even if you watched one second of my content, it honestly means the absolute world to me. I put my heart and soul in every single thing that I produce and I post on Iggy's Sports Talk. And I, I honestly really appreciate all the support that everyone has, has given me over the past year and a half. I just wanted to use this video and podcast as a way to give you a little bit of an update on my life and an update on how I'm looking to go forward with Iggy Sports Talk, not only as a brand, but as a podcast. Something that I've struggled with for the past three years is mental health. I, I, I've struggled with anxiety, not feeling good enough, and it's been an interesting journey throughout this time, and I've learned a lot. I've met a lot of people and I've figured out a way to sort of control my mental health. And I've seen throughout these past years that I have really learned more about mental health, how much it really affects people in sports, and obviously mainly people in society as well. And from everything that I've learned over these past few years and everything that I've experienced, if I would be able to use my voice and especially this podcast to help people like yourself or others in society figure out how to fix their mental health, that's a win in my book. I, I want to be able to use this podcast as a way to motivate and influence people to be greater than themselves, strive for their dreams like I have, because quite honestly, I I've had a lot of people tell me that I couldn't make this possible. And it's been incredible this past journey, just believing in myself and knowing that I'm going to get there if I believe in myself and if I strive for my dreams. And if I'm able to use this podcast and the different people that I interview to help you gain that same exact feeling, I've achieved my goal, quite honestly. And I want to use this podcast to bring on different people within sports and also within society who have been successful who have been able to overcome their mental health struggles and be able to motivate people like yourself and use this podcast as a platform to help inspire and influence people to be themselves, not worry about what anybody else thinks on the outside world and to strive for your greatness. I believe that we are all put on this earth for a certain purpose. We all have a why. And throughout this next chapter of Iggy's Sports Talk, if I'm able to help you find that why or purpose from within, quite honestly, that, that's just a dream come true to me, quite honestly. Because you guys have given me so much by supporting me throughout this past year and a half, almost two years, that if I'm able to give back and help you find your why and your purpose, that is my goal. And so I'm so excited for this next chapter of Iggy's Sports Talk. I'm going to be focusing not only on different relevant sports topics, but I'm also going to be focusing on mental health, not only within sports, but within society. I'm going to be bringing on many professional athletes that have dealt with mental health, understand their experiences and what they've gone through. It's because I think it's been pretty incredible to see different people come out of their comfort zone, like Drew Robinson. He had a whole E60 about how, unfortunately, during COVID, he attempted committing suicide. He lost his eye, and he luckily was able to get another chance at this life. And now he's playing AAA baseball with only one eye. Incredible inspirational story. 
He's one of the people that I strive to interview one day in this life. And I hope you are as excited as I am for this next chapter of Iggy's Sports Talk. And like I said before, I hope to use this platform, this podcast, my voice to help you, inspire you to be yourself, strive for your dreams, and live this life to the fullest. Thank you so much, as always, for all the support. Again, I, I, I really appreciate it so much. I'm so excited for this next chapter of Iggy's Sports Talk, so let's get it started.